What's up guys? We are back at that place where they have vending machines, vending machines, and even more vending machines. There are so many foods at the vending machine here. Uh -huh. I don't um, how many? 40? 40? 40 different yeah. machines? I think so. <laughs> yeah, I think so too. But the last time we were here, which was last week, we had uh, some udo noodles, we had soba, we had some uh, yaki onigiri, but uh, this time we decided maybe we try some snacks, hot snacks and a burger. Perhaps. Burger, hot snacks, burger. A burger from the vending machine. These are all non-alcoholic beer slash cocktail beverages. We got the Asahi Dry Zero. This is a non-alcoholic beverage. We got this one. Uh, they're using 100% German wheat, non-alcoholic as well. Then we got Asahi Style Balance. This is a lemon sour taste non-alcoholic beverage. Yuzu Shu. This is a yuzu liqueur type, with also non-alcohol. And then we got Umeshu, which is like a ume wine type of thing. I'm gonna get the Asahi Dry Zero because that's actually pretty good. It's 150 yen, not bad. So I'll put 200 yen in there. Oh. Here we go. That's my Asahi Dry Zero. We're here at the burger machine. Let's get a burger. It's 280. So we're gonna put 300 yen inside the machine. 300 yen. And your change comes out. So my change. I'm gonna press that button for the burger. It's sold out. It's sold out? Oh, this one. Yep. Okay. <laughs> there we go. And that means it is warming up. It's going to take. 54 seconds, 54 long seconds. I feel like the seconds go by slower. I don't know, maybe it's just my imagination, but it kind of looks slow to me. Four, three, two, one. It's ready. Oh, well, oh here he is. someone's at the door. Check it out. It's a pretty small burger, but hey, at least it's a burger from a vending machine. As you can see, it's super windy today and we're afraid the sound is going to be all uh, screwed up. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to buy everything at the vending machines now and we're going to eat all the food in the car. Five, four, Three, See? two, these seconds one are very slow. <laughs> Zero. <laughs> there we go. So, come, 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 come. Oh, I, what? Oh, what? there it is. Oh, there it is. Okay. Yeah, it just doesn't make a sound. It's a very quiet karage. So this is the Torino karage chicken. Now we're also gonna get the the French fries. Yeah, potato butter. So this one is 250 yen. There you go. I hope this one's quicker. Here. 117 seconds. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Zero. This video is not slow motion. <laughs> okay. Here is. Oh wow, it's wow. Oh, it's it's like balloon. Ah, <sighs> it's so nice and cozy inside the car. Also warm as well. All right, so uh, I'm going to start off with my drink. This is my non-alcoholic drink, Asahi Dry Zero, the number one best-selling non-alcoholic beer in Japan. That's what it says. But anyway, oh Excuse me. Whoa. <laughs> All right, cheers. In Japan, we say 
。乾杯。That's good stuff. I like real beer, but I also like、uh, this Asahi and Kirin brand、uh, non alcoholic beer. Actually, Asahi is better. This is my favorite now. It used to be Kirin, but now I like the non alcoholic Asahi brand better. That's just my opinion, of course. Okay, so this is the burger that came from the vending machine. It's quite small.、Um, it simply says Hambaga. In Japanese, but on the side it says it's a teriyaki burger. Yeah,、oh, I did not know that. Yeah, it's a teriyaki burger. It comes in a little wrapper like this, a paper wrapper, kind of reminds me of an old school hamburger. And this is what it looks like.、Uh, let's see what if there's anything on the inside.、Um, the bun is really, really soft. The inside is a patty.、Um, you, de- you do see some like,、uh, like burnt edges. I wonder if that's from the microwave. And I'm not sure what that, that is on the top. It, it kind of looks like onions. And on the bottom side, there's actually nothing. All right, so looks like there's no ketchup or mustard or anything whatsoever. All right, so let's give this some、um, sad looking burger a try. It's kind of sad looking, isn't it? It's wrinkled too. Itakimasu. Hmm. Mm hmm. The bun is really nice and soft. Good news is that the bun is not dry at all whatsoever. It's not chewy either. You know, I was imagining maybe the bun might get chewy from you know, being microwave, but it's not.、Um, the burger itself definitely is not 100% beef. It's,、um, look at the box, it says beef, chicken, and pork, and others. I wonder what others mean. And then there's,、uh, they're using、um, onions, and they're using.、Um, Um, I know, some kind of teriyaki sauce, but I don't taste the teriyaki sauce yet. Let me take another bite. Hmm, teriyaki sauce is non existent for me. Hmm, that's what it looks like on the inside. Um, it's not terrible or anything, it's just that for me, it's not that great. It's, it's okay if I was dying for a burger. And all the other burger places were closed? Sure, why not? Itadakimasu. Hamburger from vending machine. The、um, patty, I think, it's pretty thick as a vending machine food. I'm expecting a very thin patty, but it's not. Itadakimasu. Hmm, for me, the patty is not bad. It's Very nostalgic Japanese hamburger steak flavor. It's my childhood taste, so it's not bad for me. But the box says this is teriyaki burger, but I don't taste any teriyaki flavor. <laughs> so, we are eating hamburger. What is a pairing food? I think potato. This is potato butter. I don't know what that means. Maybe butter flavored potato french fry. いただきます。うん。うん。うん。あ。バター。I understand this butter. うん。うん。うん。The texture is a little bit mushy or soggy, not crispy. It's like a steamed potato. These are my potatoes. They're sticking together, which isn't like a bad, bad thing, but. We'll see. Hmm. I see. You should not look at this as french fries or fried potatoes. You actually should look at this as potato sticks. Yeah. Potato sticks that have been once fried and then steamed. That's what it tastes like. Taste wise, it's not bad, actually. Kind of reminds me of something my mom used to make me. Basically, they are. Potatoes that were julienne, and she would just stir fry it in a little bit of butter in a frying pan, and then she'd pour soy sauce over it. So, this is kind of like that, but without the soy sauce. It's a little bit buttery, not so much. I actually don't hate it, to be honest with you. I prefer this to the burger. Yeah, if I had a choice, I would choose this over the burger. All right, finally, we have karaage, which is Japanese style fried chicken. Comes in the same type of box. And it comes very, very piping hot. 
and there are five pieces in here with a toothpick included for easy eating. All right, let's give this one a try. Mm. This is actually pretty good. Hmm. This is good. Super flavorful. Super juicy on the inside. A little bit oily because it's been deep fried, obviously. But it has a nice peppery taste. Lots of good flavor. I like this. Oh, this is good. It even retains a little bit of crispiness. Even though, you know, like time has gone by. Overall, this is the best one. Oh. Mmm. <laughs> this one has good chicken flavor. It's like a fried chicken, which I buy at a festival. Festival Yatai, the, the street food shop. It's like that. The flavor is good. Hmm, this is good. It's a salt and pepper with soy sauce flavor. I need beer, but I'm driving. <laughs> I can't drink now. Next time, I will come by train. All right, time for dessert, guys. So we found an ice cream machine here. There's actually three ice cream machines all together, but um, we never had these before. Actually, I've never seen these at any stores. So they have vanilla, they have strawberry, they got bitter chocolate, they have blueberry, as well as matcha azuki. So, um, which one do you want? You got a preference? Blueberry. Blueberry, all right, we'll get blueberry ice cream. Okay, it's 300 yen. Let's go and put the money in here. Uh, press this here. Blueberry. And this one should come out right away, right? What? I was like, how am I going to eat this? <laughs> I was worried a bit. I was like, how am I going to eat this? I don't have a spoon. I'm a little bit thirsty. I want to drink something. And I found interesting one. Yamagata Pine Cider. What is Yamagata Pine Cider? I don't know that. <laughs> pine is a pineapple. Pineapple cider from Yamagata. Yamagata original. Oh, this one. This one. The manufacturer is located in Yamagata. <laughs> All right, let's go back in the car because it's really cold. So we're back in the car, guys. So this is the ice cream. This is the Vanaga Blueberry Ice Cream by Okui Zumo Premium Brand. This is the pure Japanese taste. Oh, check it out. So I see bits of blueberry inside. And it is... Oh, it's pretty hard. Mmm, mmm, so cold. First of all, lots of plump blueberries in this one. A lot of plump blueberries, really fresh tasting. Very milky, um, almost, I don't know, it almost seems too milky because the milk flavor is really strong to the point where it actually almost overpowers the blueberry. I know that there's blueberries inside here and I can feel the blueberries like popping in my mouth. It's just that the taste of the milk is really strong. I don't know, maybe they use a really rich milk. That's super rich tasting. It's good though. I do wish that the blueberry taste was a little bit more prominent because it's like, yeah, it's, it's very milky. Hmm. You try it, let me, let, me, let me know what you think, Satoshi-san. Ooh, nice. A little bit of violet color. very milky very milky ice cream i expected much more stronger ex blueberry flavor please add more blueberry taste Onegaishimasu. so this is yamagata pine cider yamagata is my hometown and it's cold place it's not a warm place like hawaii so pineapple is not a specialty in yamagata but this is pine cider pineapple cider. The manufacturer is located in Yamagata. I already mentioned. So open it. <sighs> Nostalgic! Uh, when I was a child, there was a pine cider, pineapple cider. 
I don't think it is made in Yamagata, but there was. The flavor, this flavor is like that. Everything I eat here is nostalgic for me. The flavor wise, texture wise, aroma, very nostalgic. Everything. Ramen noodles, soba, udon noodles, and the hamburger patty. And this pineapple cider is also like that. Very refreshing and rightly sweetened. Not super sweet, not overly sweet. It's a good point. So we've come to the end of another pretty delicious,、uh, very economical meal. <laughs> <laughs> Did you have any favorites? What were your thoughts on what we had today? Today's my favorite is the karaage. The karaage? Chicken karaage.、Mm, not、That's、the pineapple、good. soda? Pineapple soda <laughs> is also good, <laughs> but、uh, karaage is good. I really, really respect the owner's effort、mm. because they fix those vending machines、mm. and they collect the nostalgic food for suitable for vending machines. No, that's true. No, I agree.、Um, because you really don't find these t y p e of vending machines in the city anymore.、Um, I actually don't even know if they have. Food vending machines in Tokyo. I、mm. haven't seen any recently. The last time I saw was、uh, Oden, but that was like three years ago. And I don't,、right. I don't think it's there anymore. So it's nice to have a collection like this. As you can see, today we drove here, we rented a car because it's cold and it's quite far from where we live, but it is accessible by public transportation. Once again, the address is below this video in the description. Right. You know what interests me the most is、uh, that vending machine where they have the canned ramen. They have canned shoyu ramen, canned miso ramen, canned tonkotsu ramen. In the same one, they have consomme soup, they had a corn soup, they had yakitori, they had oden, which is a Japanese stew, all in one machine, which is very interesting to me. Did you have any machines that interested you?、Uh, and in any other hot vending machine, hot, hot food vending machine? The hot food one, the one、yes. with the tendon, for example, yeah, yeah, right? Yeah. yeah. Anyway, sorry, my favorite was the beer. And then after that, <laughs> sorry, sorry. My favorite, other than the beer, Was actually those soggy potatoes, the one that <laughs> you didn't like. <laughs> I like them. I like them. I like potatoes, and they were pretty good. Yeah. So, anyway, thank you for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to press that like button. And if you're new to our channel, we would love it if you subscribe. Thank you for watching. See you next food adventure. Bye bye.